Paris, a great city with a high line. New York, a great city with a high line. Sydney, a great city, it has a high line in waiting. Starting north of Luna Park, the High Line will be a walk that connects a number of established and delightful harbourside parks. On the left is Art Barton Park and the Peter Kingston Walkway. On the right is Wendy's Secret Garden, the labour of love. Ahead is 300 metres of tunnel with layers of soot on its cathedral ceiling, evidence of the many years of steam trains. Above the tunnel lies the suburb of McMahon's Point, with its long history of marine-associated activity. The tunnel opens onto Sawmiller's Reserve, a sloping embankment planted with native vegetation and open grassy foreshores. On the left is Berry's Bay and Waverton Park, leading to Waverton Station. Further west is the Coal Loader and then Ball's Head Reserve, a forested headland. When joining the walk from the Waverton Station end, the first entry point will be at Union Street, where level access will be available and will facilitate wheelchair access. The walkway will continue south to the John Street Bridge. On the John Street Bridge, there will be a cantilevered walkway where once an old rail line was situated. Berry's Bay then comes into view with the beautiful former Manly Ferry, South Stain. Then onwards towards Dumbarton Street, where the walkway and streetscape integrate. Again, there will be level access to the High Line walkway. The walkway will continue under the Victoria Street Bridge, past the Scout Hall on the southern side. The walkway then continues to the tunnel. The everyday tunnel lighting will be designed with safety in mind. It will be bright so that faces will show up clearly on CCTV. There will also be the opportunity to provide vivid style lighting for special occasions. Emerging from the tunnel, the walkway proceeds along the foreshore of Lavender Bay, a beautiful cove so near but yet so far from the hustle and bustle of the main harbour. On the other side is the viaduct and Wendy's Secret Garden, and below the garden there is space for a cafe and toilet facilities. Ahead is the platform of the original Lavender Bay station, it is anticipated that a 19th century style station will be built to complement the heritage trains that will share the High Line with walkers. The Sydney Harbour High Line will be a linear garden connecting the various parks into a grand mosaic. A new Sydney icon.